Well, many people say over and over how they want to lose weight and try diet after diet or countless workout plans, which always seem to fail. And what if these techniques aren't the problem? What if you are actually sabotaging your own weight loss goals? Joining me now is health and fitness expert Stephanie Mansour, and she created Step It Up with Steph to help people feel better mentally and physically. And, and Steph, we're talking about sabotaging your own weight loss goals. Oh, that sounds ridiculous because why would someone do that? Exactly. Well, most people don't even know that they are sabotaging their own weight loss goals. And the way that they're doing this is that their reasons for wanting to lose weight are not synced up with what they really, really want for themselves. So people may say, I want to lose 10 pounds because I hate my body. Well, you know, Carrie, if I hate you, why would I be nice to you? You know, so you're not going to be nice to your body. Right, exactly. Okay. If you hate your body, you're not going to be nice to your body. You're not going to work out. You're not going to try to eat healthy, maybe for a week or two, but eventually it's just not going to stick. So how do you figure out if you're actually doing that? Because I think that might be a hard part. You're like, oh, wait, maybe I am doing that. Right, exactly. So I have my clients create mantras. So what you're going to do is you're going to write down why you want to lose weight. So you want to lose weight because you hate your body, or is it you want to lose weight so that you will love your body, so that you will feel more confident, so that you will like how you fit in your clothing? What are the actual reasons why you want to lose your weight? And then that will help motivate you to actually do it. So the bigger the why, the more found the why, the easier the how. Okay, so you have to change your thinking there right away. So how right. do you actually go about then unsabotaging? Right. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, once we get, so, so we don't want to lose weight because we hate our bodies. We don't want to lose weight because, you know, we have to fit into a bridesmaid's dress for a wedding. We don't want to lose weight because we want to, you know, snag the guy or because our husband wants mm -hmm. us to lose 10 pounds. We want to lose weight for ourselves. We want to empower ourselves to take control over our bodies and over our lives and actually stick to a plan. So you want to map out a plan so that you have a better percentage of actually following through with the plan. So and you have somewhere where you can go and get all this information. Right, exactly. To help you. Yes, on my website. I I have actually um, a new 30-day workbook, 30 Days to Love Your Body and Your Life, and it takes you step-by-step step through changing those beliefs about why you want to lose weight or look better and get it so that it comes more from a deeper place within yourself. And then it also gives you step-by-step -step instructions on how you can go about okay. losing weight and feeling better about yourself. And your website is? It's stepitupwithsteph.com. Okay, real easy to remember. Yep. All right, thanks. <laughs>